My this reading is for Capricorns who were cheated on in the past six months to a year and they're still dealing with the betrayal. This is for Capricorn Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus sign. Capricorns who were cheated on in serious committed partnership, relationships, and or marriages. So this is looking at kind of hidden energy about karmically why this has occurred with Capricorn. We're also going to look at things that might be hidden from the Capricorn right now. These are Capricorns who were cheated on. And we are going to take some general advice from the good tarot deck there for Capricorn for the month of February 2018. So let's see where we are, guys. I'm going to take this one. So we have the black mass. So for the Capricorns who were cheated on, they might be feeling quite vindictive. Like they're going to make the person who cheated on them pay. And this is not to judge anybody. I'm just going by the cards that are there. We have the carrying card, the card of carrying. This is... A card about remembering the inner child. This is a cancer verbal energy, but this might be a bit from the Capricorn. Either someone's doing this to the Capricorn or the Capricorn's doing this to the person who cheated on them. This is the seducer, major arcana. Look at this energy, guys. Just so when I tell you what I'm getting, no one gets too angry at me. So for me, this feels a bit like manipulation. Um... I keep getting threats, uh, play nice, or you're going to pay. This is the energy that it feels like. For This is an assumption that the Capricorn is no longer with the person, but still may have to be in contact with the person. That's what it feels like. This is the fall. And we have the Ellen King. So I feel like the person who has cheated on the Capricorn is feeling quite intimidated especially if you're going over separation of property or you're still in the process of dissolving the relationship uh, the Capricorn feels like they have the upper hand it looks like the Capricorn has the upper hand and the other person has really taken a blow by ending the relationship let me show you why guys we have the king who has fallen and he's being made fun of by the jester and now this is the Elling king in bed see his little hat off his crown and his coat on the chair so it looks like the person who crossed paths with the capricorn and cheated on them it looks like the Capricorn was very much ready to will and deal. This is what popped, guys. This is the king of coins. This is a very Capricorn card. The Capricorn was very much capable to take control of the situation and almost, yeah, just take care of themselves, especially from a financial standpoint or an asset standpoint. The Capricorn seems to be very calculating. The person who cheated on the Capricorn is not having an easy time right now in life, by the way. Um, they're struggling a bit, especially if they've taken some financial hits. We have the Three of Wands matched up with caring. We have the Five of Coins. Again, this feels like the energy for the other person. They're trying to figure out how... Uh, if they haven't totally left the life of the Capricorn, they might be trying to figure out how to come back because perhaps they're missing some stability also in their own life. We have the Three of Cups. This is almost feeling like they thought things would be better than they actually are for them in reality. And we have the Ten, I'm sorry, the Nine of Cups for Capricorn. <clears throat> Yeah, this could be, yeah, I keep feeling like I got them beat, like the Capricorn is, if there's a lot of disputes or discussions, somehow the Capricorn is well prepared and winning at every turn. And this has really taken the person aback and they have to regroup and, but they can't seem to get on top of the situation. 
They also may want to come back. The person who cheated on the Capricorn may be trying to come back. Kind of, they've humbled, they've been humbled, and they're possibly trying to come back uh, into the partnership with the uh, Capricorn. So for the, the tarot cards, we have uh, two major arcana. We have the hangman energy, we have the empress, and we have the queen of fire. So again, this is a power card. This is the Capricorn taking a less emotional, even though the emotions are there, they're taking a much more strategic approach to either repairing the relationship, accepting the person back, or dissolving the relationship and gaining assets from uh, the ending of the relationship. The other person may be feeling a bit like this, like they can't move forward. The Capricorn may have restricted the finances or taken control over the bank account. Uh, and again, the, the Capricorn seems like they're holding their own. They're going to stand in their power. They're going to take what they believe to be theirs, what they've earned, what they've established in the partnership and relationship. Get their cut first. That's what I have. So for Capricorn, that's what I have for the Capricorns who were cheated on in the past six months to 12 months, and they are uh, still having to deal with the person uh, who cheated on them. That's what I have for Capricorn for the month of February 2018. Thank you for joining me. I will see you guys next month. Bye-bye.